Hello, welcome back to the Volabs channel. In this video tutorial, we will learn how to check the bolt strength over the centrifugal force in a wind turbine that rotates around 200 RPM, or around 21 radians per second, with the constant angular speed at 0.18 radians per second square. We will ignore the aerodynamic force and other forces toward the blades in this simulation. Before we start, just to remind you that centrifugal force is a force that acts on a body in a direction away from the center, which contributes to making the body try to fly away. In a wind turbine, the blades are affected by this force and we need to make sure that the bolts we have chosen can hold the blades in their places. So, let's get started. First of all, we need to create a new assembly file, and then load the components into the assembly and make those components together. Next, apply the material to each components. We will use stainless steel for the central ring and aluminium alloy for the blades. Then we activate the SOLIDWORKS simulation and create a new study.
After everything is ready, we will first define the fixation which is located in the center ax. Next, we will add the bolt connections. Choose the type of the connection and define the positions. For the screw material, we can either choose from the library or just input by ourselves the mechanical properties. Don't forget also to define the thread pitch and the preload torque of the screw. Repeat the step for the rest of the screws. Next, we need to define the contact or interaction between the components. And finally, we define the centrifugal force. We input the typical values for the domestic-sized wind turbine, which is 200 RPM rotational speed, or around 21 radians per second, and the angular acceleration of 0.18 radians per second square.
seems everything is ready. Now we can create the mesh and run the simulation. Here is it, we have the simulation results. You can click to see and animate each result. In the displacement result, it seems that the value is very low that means the screws do a good job to hold the blades in their places. Now, we will check the bolt strength are they okay or we need to change to the bigger ones? Yay! All of the screws are okay. We don't need to change these M8 screws for this assembly. For further analysis, you can click the details and copy the values for your report. That is all, it is easy right? I hope you enjoy this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe for the new interesting tutorial like this. See you!